stand. Peace on this planet, or guns glowing hot. We lay there together as if we were getting something done. It felt like planting a garden or planning a meal for a people who still need feeding. All that touching, or barely touching, not saying much, not adding anything, the cushion of it, the skin, and occasional sigh, all seemed like work worth mastering. I'm sure somebody died while we made love. Somebody killed somebody black. I thought then of holding you as a political act. I may as well have held myself. We didn't stand for one thought, didn't do a damn thing. And though you left me, I'm glad we didn't. There's a, um, thank you. There's a, um, there's an echo that you might hear um, from a, another poem I read um, in this last poem. And the reason you hear it is because um, both poems are a form I created, um, invented is the word we're using these days, a form I invented uh, called the duplex. The duplex merges the sonnet, the hustle, and the blues. Um, this last poem I'm going to read for you is a duplex, but it's also a cento. Um, as you know, a cento is a poem that takes its lines from other poems. Uh, usually those poems are from other sources, but uh, the final duplex, the final poem in the book is a duplex that is made up of the lines of all the other duplexes in the book. I just, I didn't want to read that line again that I had said earlier when I read a duplex and have y'all think that I didn't have no idea how to write a new line. <laughs> so, you know, you know, making the duplexes was a lot of work and then making this cento really drove me crazy. But it was what I do because I'm a poet and poets are attracted to difficulty. <laughs> Which I have to say is a great thing if you want to be a poet. It's really a useful trait to have an attraction to difficulty if you want to be a poet. Not so good if you want to be in a relationship. Duplex, Cento. My last love drove a burgundy car, color of a rash, a symptom of sickness. We were the symptoms, the road, our sickness. None of our fights ended where they began. None of the beaten end where they begin. Any man in love can cause a messy corpse but I didn't want to leave a messy corpse obliterated in some lilied field, stench obliterating lilies of the field, the murderer young and unreasonable. He was so young, so unreasonable, steadfast and awful, tall as my father, steadfast and awful. My tall father was my first love. He drove a burgundy car. Thank you all so much.